Hello friends, in this video tutorial you are going to learn how to download and install Android Studio and make your first program in Android Studio by using Kotlin. First of all, for downloading Android Studio, type Android Studio Download. Then Make sure the address of the site is developer.android.com. Click on it. As the internet connection is a little bit weak, so it is taking time. Now. Then from here, click on Download Android Studio. Scroll down. Check. I have read the terms and condition and download. Click on Download. And you can see that the download has been started. It will take some time. It took some time. And finally, the Android Studio file has been downloaded. It was almost 950 MB file. Now, click on it and then click on Open. Now, you can see that the file has started working now. Do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device? Yes, I want it. Then click next. Yes. Next. 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 install and installation has been started it is taking time but your journey for learning the coding to make android apps will also take time but it will be fruitful to you guys be patient being patient is not easy but it is fruitful then click next finish And here you go. Android Studio is being started. Still, it will do some work to install and prepare some extra components. It will take some time. We are facing the problem that the main window of Android Studio is not showing. We can do this as I was working with a project, and now the Android Studio has directly opened that project, but I want to go back to the main window. How can I go back? Click on File, then click on Settings. After that, click on System Settings. And then here you can see the op under the heading of Project, you can see the option of Reopen on Startup. Reopen Projects on Startup. Uncheck this. Click o Apply. Okay, now close the Android Studio, exit, now again open the Android Studio, it's taking time and here you can see that I have come back to the main window of android studio now let's build 
our first step in Android Studio using Kotlin. This is the latest Android Studio. So this will be the interface of this latest Android Studio. Click on New Project. Then from here you have options for which device you want to make this application. I select phone and tablet, then search for a basic activity or empty activity. So this is as we want a very simple app. So I will click on an empty activity. Search for empty activity from these templates. Click next. And from here, you select your language as it is in Kotlin by default. And from here, it is the name of the application here it is the name package name which you will normally uh, see it as a reverse of a domain com dot example everything this this is a root file everything or every logic you apply on your application will be stored in this package name then here is the save location on your device you can change it if you want to change and here sdk now we will select the basic Android version. For example, I want to select Marshmallow. For Marshmallow, the API level, API level, Android API level is 23. API stands for Android Programming Interface. Click on it, then click on Finish. And now it will start building your app. It will do all the necessary things which are needed in this application it will take a huge time it will take a huge huge time it took a lot of time in my case it took 25 minutes the time for doing everything right for you will depend on your internet speed or and the speed of your computer now from here after that if you have any problem if you find any problem then you will you can see do those problems here at the bottom under the heading of build after uh, when you will click the build you will see the problem and you will be you will click on that problem and if anything necessary is needed the android studio will do it for you automatically when you will click on it now click on design window or design view here in this design view you can change the theme of your Android app. And also you can click on tools and after that device manager. Then here by clicking on create device Basically here you are creating an AVD, Android virtual device. Select whatever mobile you want. For example, I am selecting Pixel 2 and click next. Uh, I select some other. Create a device and I will select some other. Which, which, is, which is simple for us. I will click on pixel and then click next. And what system I want to select? System is, I want to select a system API 30. And then here something is missing. I will click on it. Next. And it will, yes. And it will start downloading that thing which is needed in creating that AVD. Finish. Here you also need to download system image. I am downloading for Nougat. Whose API level is 24 and it is Android 7.0. Now here you can see a little, a tiny download button. Click on it. And it is a 775 MB file. It will take some time. 
it took some time and now the api 22 file has been downloaded and after unzipping automatically now we will click on finish and everything is refreshing now now you can see that the warning message has been disappeared from here now i will click next and here you will select portrait or landscape i leave it to portrait mode and here you you can see the advanced settings if you want to check it you can do it then i will click finish and here it goes now from here i will click on play run app now here you can see that he is it is saying that to launch a virtual machine it is taking time now the emulator is uh, emulator will take time to run now let's see what happens it will take some time and here it goes it is loading here you can see here is our application which whose name was my application so our application our first application in android studio using kotlin has been finished if this video helps you in any way please subscribe my channel and hit the like button thanks for watching thanks for your time goodbye